Where's the pause one? Nope. That's my belt. Oh no, because it's on my shirt. Hang on. There it is. Right. How are you all doing? Not what I had planned to talk about today. Video. Not. Which rolls into something else. Things don't always go according to plan, man. So there's no need to get stressed about it. So let it wash over you. I say that as a stress head. <laughs> I'm a stress head. I am pretty much fueled by stress, spite, bile, anger, whatever. That's my groove, man. I'm here just to wind people up. But sometimes it just ain't worth letting things get you down. Not everything is going to go according to plan. Not everything is going to go by the book. Not everything is going to go exactly how you have it planned, when you have it planned. It's just not going to happen. The world has too many variables. I think I've already said that about a million times this month. I've only been making videos again for a month. So, let that be a, a thing that sticks in your head. It's just things aren't going to go according to plan. Wash over, don't get stressed. So, what's the groove then, mate? What's made you think that? Well, they say think that comes in threes, right? Bad things come in threes. And we recently had a really expensive device fail. Had to send it in. And the device ain't that old. And we had to spend 600 plus on getting it repaired. Like half the value of the device. It was ridiculous. If we include that, then uh, oh, what was the other one? What was the other one? Uh, someone said a phone. I don't think it was a phone. What was the other stuff? Oh yeah, the, the phone line. Sorry, the phone line. The the internet went down. So there's two, and 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 three. This morning, came downstairs. No heat. It's wet. no hot water. Hot water is generally wet, but you know what I mean? There's, there's the, around an area in, in, the, in the kitchen was wet, that shouldn't be wet. Boiler had gone pop. So, as I say, no heat, no hot water. It just, it just happened. I was, kind of should have known there was something funky going on when, like, that might have been last night, night before, part of the kitchen side was wet. I was like, there's nothing around here to spill. There's a, there's a microwave and some plug sockets. Why are these wet? Just wiped it over, didn't think anything of it. And then now, boiler's gone. And the reason I bring up the whole thing, you know, just chill out, things aren't going to go according to plan, wash over, just, you know, it's because we're talking to uh, the, the landlord or the agency. That we go through. So like, you know, have we got an inspection coming up or anything? They're like, hey, is there anything we need to do? You know, because, uh, you know, we can't exactly do an inspection. We just figured we'd check in, see how you guys are getting on. And uh, and literally during the phone call, just the things went pop and, and kind of stopped, stopped, uh, stopped working. And they're like, you know, you guys are really chill. You're always chilled out. Because like, there's no point letting anything, there's no point letting this stuff get your aggro don't let stuff like this ruin your day there's always other ways to go about it i mean it's not the first time we're going without having a boiler so it's not something that i'm gonna get particularly aggro with there's other ways to get hot water in the house there's other ways to keep warm you know what i mean not everyone on this planet happens to have a nice combi boiler so they somehow survive and i'm sure we will too but there are just too many things you can't control so try not to become too much of a stress head. Don't let uh, things get you down, you know? Sometimes you are going to get aggro. If you're an aggro dick and you did something wrong, you better feel bad about it. But otherwise, you know, just just let it go, man. Just level out. Just chill out, son. It's all good. So outside of that, what have we been up to? Repairing computers. Updating the Gemini site site capsule badly and uh, transferring many 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 files 
over to the Synology NAS that I mentioned yesterday. Not going to cover the Synology NAS today, but my gods know that whilst that Synology is expensive, it's got a lot of features in it. My god, it's got some amazing features in it. Email server built straight in, chat server built straight in, the ability to deploy all of these really rad things just right on the box. Just, hey, do you want to do that? Yeah, just click. Just click. That's the craziest. Got these two these two personalities, man. You've got this super simple click it and things work mode. Or you can go mega hardcore nerd mode where I can put my thick rim glasses on and my, my beard goes grey and really long and I can become a wizard and do my, my techno stuff on it and it does all this other things that just... It is literally open up, it's opened up like uh, having an actual full-blown server on my desk. That's nuts. I mean, I've, I've got a full-blown server out back, but... Damn, that little... You can't see it's there. It's right uh, there. Right there. That's insane. Most other, you know, if you get a, con a consumer level, like, you know, two, 200 pound or so NAS... It's like usually a single bay with a few little features on it. That thing's a beast. It's like, I was saying to people like, hey, should we, should we want to just chat and just use this? Should we just set up like a little chat server on there and just... Because why not? It's like, hey, man, we've got a downloader built in. Do you want to torrent some stuff or FTP some stuff? Hey, do you want to run a server on here? I'm like... I just want to store my files, man. And so I've been transferring gigs and gigs and gigs and gigs and gigs of files. And then I found that, for some reason, it's got a beef against uh, uh, Philip K. Dick. It doesn't like question marks. And file system, it doesn't like question mark in the times. No! I'm not copying over that file. No! If you're curious why Philip K. Dick, um, uh, do androids dream of electric sheep? Is that, the, is that the title? Blade Runner. Renamed Blade Runner. It's what the film Blade Runner's based on the Philip K. Dick book, Sheep, Androids, Dreams, has a question mark, wouldn't have it, I was like, nah mate, rename it, I was like, fine, <laughs> so I renamed it, as I say, put some RAM in a little computer, which is kind of bugging me right now, because oh, RAM ain't cheap, and ugh, could really do with a graphics card, but ugh, graphics cards are definitely ain't cheap. <laughs> Especially not low profiles right now. Hey, do you want to spend two hundred and fifty pounds on a graphics card that used to be only be like one hundred and twenty-five? I'm like, <laughs> no. Do you want to play that same price secondhand? <laughs> no. So, Nvidia, AMD, the chip manufacturers really pull your fingers out, please. I mean, I know we're in the middle of a bit of a there's a bit of a situation going on globally. Well, you know, come on. I need a graphics card. <laughs> Ideally, three of them. Please. And there's some replacement fans. Be nice. Transferring files. Drinking tea. Not getting stressed. It's not getting stressed, man. It's not worth it. And uh, just quickly about the, the file stuff organizing. Originally, I was just I was going to copy everything over and just go. I'm going to organize it as this and this. And in the end, I was like, you know what? Sod it. I'm just going to make a directory for each computer that I want to copy stuff over. Drag and drop the home directory over, and then I will just I'll sort it out when it's over there. <laughs> so everything is a mess. It's broken, but it's late. Screw it. I'm going to. I don't know. Maybe play some Monster Hunter. Listen to some tunes on some really cheap earbuds. It's no need to get angry. Just don't. Not yet. I can think of many other things that would make me angry, but... Lack of heat and hot water? It's no big deal. Just have a cold shower. Boil a kettle. Put some pans on a hob. All still alive. Right? I'll uh, see you all with a bit of luck.
in the next one. Hmm, does that mean that don't get mad, get evens? Kind of been thrown out the window there. Yeah, don't know how I feel to that one.